Hey, all my fantastic numismatic artistic friends, it's me, Master Temple. Are you all doing good? <laughs> Happy days. Right, we've got the big, big daddy album out because we've got a new coin to put in this. But before we do that, we'll go look at that coin. I've got a little bit of a letter here that was sent to me by my good friend and fellow Yorkshireman and Yorkshire lady, Bungle. I won is a little bit of a cheeky giveaway. Um, on one of his videos and uh, I was quite quite surprised quite surprised by it I was actually doing some 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 painting and I got a message off uh, Katie Jones Corn saying you've got to get over to Bungle's live stream drop everything you're doing you've uh, you've been you've been chosen you're the chosen one Dan so um, I went over there and uh, as it as it happens I won something and uh, what I chose what I won is amazing. In fact, I think I won two things if memory serves me right. So we'll just get into this on Bungle's members giveaway. So if you're not a member over there, get your sent over. Do your duty. Right, and that's Bungle's PO box, by the way, Yorkshire. Right, S slide this out. Let's slide this out. Nothing in there. This is what I were after. <laughs> this is what I were after. The fifty. I had a choice of this or a, the slack handful of coins, and I, I went for the note, and they've signed it the back. Bungle. Two thousand four hundred and thirty-six subs, and Lady M there. The fantastic people. They are fantastic. Great stuff. Congratulations, my fantastic friend. Keep this dual-dated coin safe. You won't find many in circulation. Much love, Bungle. <laughs> you see, I chose this. I chose the note. And then I could pick anything that uh, that he, uh, that, the, that, the, that they found in the hunts. And... Um, and there, there was, was there an Olympic in there? An Olympic? I think there's definitely a Flopsy Bunny and a couple of other nice coins, but I wanted the dual date coin. I got that was new, was there a Newton? I'm not sure. I can't remember now, but there was definitely some cracking finds. And uh, I went for this one. I wanted this one. I wanted this one. Well, now there's two in there. <laughs> I didn't expect to, I only want I only thought I'd won one. Let's get in. This looks like the dual dated coin. It is look, look at that. So this is the dual dated, come on focus my good camera, and there we've got 96, 95 and 1998 on it, 97 must have been a bad year, so yeah I wanted this one, absolutely cracking. <laughs> I'm going to put this in a capsule if I can work this out I think that's it that'll do well won't it because I also have I also have a Lady M I don't know if you can see that we've got a Lady M Benjamin Bunny and a Bongle Benjamin Bunny It's got the B there right on the schnauzer. So we'll keep that all together. But what's this one? How very bizarre. I don't know. I do not know. Don't want to be cutting through this either. Which, <laughs> let's have a look. So that's the sticker. <laughs> it says it give me a sticker for, for the old piglet. Another sticker for the piglet. <laughs> yes. 
another Taekwondo coin, brilliant bungle, my favourite Taekwondo. I'm going to put this next to the nice pile I've got now. Thank you, thank you my friends. Brilliant stuff. And this will go next to, I've only got a couple of notes, um, but I'll treasure this always. It'll go next to the, the note I got off of Cali. Oh, brilliant stuff. And they've got the sticker there as well. Nice one. I still read the book. Where are we going to put this? I still read the book. The Yorkshireman, the Yorkshire Citizen Test book. It's brilliant. <laughs> right. I'm going to put this safe. I'll be back and we'll have a look at the coin for the Big Daddy book. As I'm looking through my little box to put the stuff away safe, I found these old, um, well they're not old, these these uh, these pin badges that Bungle and Lady M were giving out down at the mint. And we've got uh, a pair of Bungle's plums and um, <laughs> Team Lady M and a Bungle collect. Never got to get them all, I never I could collect them all, yeah but... <laughs> I just thought I'd show you that. Right, brilliant, thanks guys. Let's crack on to the big, the big daddy folder. So the coin, let's find out where I put it. We are recording, aren't we? Yeah, of course we are. This one came through the post. It's the old piglet. Part of the, um, what do they call it now? Winnie the Pooh. Winnie the Pooh coin. So we need to get this in. Now this is, some people might be familiar with this. This is, 10 peas and I've got a a mixed range of alphabets there with a 2008 lion and I think that's a 20 oh no it's a 2019 shield can't remember where I got that from maybe a trade prior to doing the channel maybe anyhow these are the uh, these are the 20 peas so I've tried and got up every single I'm well, trying to find every single 20 p We've done a video on these in the past as well. Uh, we've got the undated one as well there. These are 20 piece from around the, the territories and crown dependencies. So this is the 50p run that we've got. So we start off with a big old 50 pence up at the top. And you can see that then we've got the Ring of Hands. That's Britannia, by the way. Ring of Hands. We've got a circulated table and chairs. It's a genuine one. So that's really sought after and rare. And then we've got the D-Day, the D-Day landings. Then we've got another 50p, uh, which has just got, it says 50 pence on there, whereas this one says new pence. Then we've got the smaller 2007, no, sorry, 1997, uh, 50p Britannia. Looks in really good condition, that, so we'll put that in there. And then we'll make our way through as commemoratives, including the Kew Gardens I found last November. And I've got the jumper on, guys. I've got the jumper on. So we've gone through all that. Then we've got some more Olympics that we picked up. Final bits of Olympics that we picked up. Um, Puddle Duck. 2017 Shield. 2017s, and this is when I started collecting, so I um, could get all these straight from circulation. Um, it was nice to pull out the 20 or 2018 one straight fresh from the tills because they're absolutely look without a scratch on them. And then we've got the NAFCs, or the start of the NAFC, so we've got the 20, let's zoom in a little bit if we can, 2018 snowman down here, can you see him? weighs a ton this book and then we've got the Gruffalo next to him Stephen Hawkins not a bad idea zooming in and trying to move the book <laughs> so yeah Sherlock Holmes and then we've got the two ridiculously high minted Paddington Bears we've got the second Gruffalo and then we've got the full sets of um, the 50 years of the 50p sets you know the, we've got the culture sets with the 2019 Kew Garden in 
and uh, the, the military set which has got the smaller size D-Day and then we've got a couple more which is Wallace and Gromit last year's snowman and we've got the circulated Brexit Dinosaurs, the three dinosaurs, the impaled rabbit, Team GB, DNA. What else have we got? Right, so we've got Winnie the Pooh, we've got Christopher Robin, and then we've got the diversity kind. Where are we? <laughs> be up there. The diversity kind, so we need the piglet. Now I'd love the space to pop in there. So let's do it. Let's cut this out. Now, like always, what I do is I try to keep the coin in the uh, in the plastic casing and that way it won't rotate like this one will because this is straight from circulation I think if my memory serves me right so we'll just trim off the edge trim off the edge trim off the edge there's a flap there. I can just show you. Stay focused. That flap, you want to keep that flap intact. If you cut straight across there, no flap. And you don't want to be flapless to win this. <laughs> Alright, so just trim it off as close as you dare to the coin. And let's pop old Piggy Wiggy. Excuse me a moment, folks. There. Final one. Well, saying the final one, we've got the 20, uh, 2020, 2020 snowman to go in there. That's on order. I want that on order. Um, if it comes in the next couple of days, we'll, we'll put it on a tail end bit of this video. But if not, we'll make another video at some point because there's going to be a lot more coins coming out. Hopefully, so so there, there we have it. And then one pound. Matt, we'll have to go through these at one day, and then the two pound collection that I have. And you've seen all this stuff before. I'm sure you have. We might have to go through these old ten p's, old five p's, stuff, other stuff, coinage. Anyhow, let's leave it there for now. So thanks, Bungle. Thanks, Lady M. Thank you guys for watching. Do stay safe. Take care. I'll see you all later. And of course, happy days.